Hey, what's going on, Toe Brigade? Welcome back to more Kirby Return to Dreamland Deluxe. I'm about to say, I was about to say Kirby Star Allies. Oh my gosh. No, not yet. Not yet, Rod. But anyway, what's going on, guys? Happy Thursday. How is everybody doing today? Who's ready for some more Kirby action? No, we're not watching the cutscene again. I've already told you, game. We're not watching the cutscene again. Um, anyway, so we are 22% done. Yeah, 22%, guys. What's going on, SMG, Muffin, and... What's going on? Wait, Le Lek Gang Hater? I don't think I've seen you before. What's going on there, Muffin? Why is Kirby blue? I don't know. But we got to... Last time we did... The first two areas now we're doing level three onion ocean yeah and ocean made out of onions you know if i want to swim in it or not i don't know i don't know that doesn't that doesn't sound too uh too fun i don't think i want to swim in an ocean full of onions i'll come out smelling really bad uh let me see can i actually oh i guess i can oh i guess i'll show it off later anyway yeah so Oh god, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Um this song that's playing right now is a remix of It's actually a remix of um Kine's theme from Kirby's Dream Land 2. I I'm surprised how many people didn't know. Oh, I gotta I gotta make a command for you too, uh SMJ. Cause I Because I I I didn't I didn't uh I didn't make one for you yet. I'll do that. I'm trying. I gotta figure out what I want to name. What I want to have your command be. I'll, I'll probably just name it SMG or Muffin. But yeah, this is actually my. This is one of my favorite worlds in the game. Blue Kirby took over for a second. Yeah, I don't know why. I don't. I don't understand. Cause like it showed up when I first. When on my first. My first stream too. Blue Kirby was just all of a sudden there. I don't, I don't know what that was all about because I was thinking it was going to be regular pink Kirby, but no, it was blue. It's weird. I could skip that. Whatever I think is best. Okay. Wait, what, rem what reminds you of Shrek? Uh, so I need to figure out where these um, energy spheres are. Yeah, you probably should get this. You should get this game and Forgotten Land too. I'm gonna get to that one eventually. Oh right, it's oh that's just a start. I don't need that. Oh onions, yeah. You love Kirby. He's one of your favorite video game characters. Kirby's Kirby's fun. Like Kirby's such a fun little character. He's he he's such a simple design, but at the same time he's like really really cool. And he's all he's also a badass as well. So yeah, that make the, that what you will. Uh, Tornado is. It's not like it was before. He does more stuff with this. I actually really like Tornado. I've always liked Tornado ability because it was so broken. Like, for example, if you, like, hold the button in and then just let him, like, keep going, you can actually, like, ascend, which is pretty cool. I need meat. No, it's not late. My birthday's actually tomorrow. It's, um, I did the stream yesterday because tomorrow I'm going to be busy with fam. So, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. I need this ability yeah this is that new ability that they introduced in this game in this version only in this version but it's mecha yeah how often does kirby get to cosplay as a robot oh wait he's done that for like an entire game uh, uh he's done it for a whole game what's going there can't i got your command what's going there rayhan welcome to Welcome to Kirby's Return to Dreamland Deluxe. 
You know, mech kind of reminds me of um a little bit of plasma, where you can like charge the, you can like charge the shot up. Yeah, mech's a mech is a cool ability. I wish it had a little bit more going for it, but. Oh yeah, also thanks for showing up to the stream yesterday, uh, Cam. I know you couldn't stay, but I appreciate I appreciate everybody who was able to who was able to be there yesterday. It, it really it really meant a lot because you know birthday streams are f a lot of fun. Dude, I almost broke 50 likes on that stream. It was insane. I mean, that's not my record like count, but yeah, this is easy to get. Just be quick. Wait, they wait. Did they they actually made Kirby Lego sets? Or are you saying they should? I mean, I could I could see a Kirby Lego set. Imagine imagine a Lego um King Dedede. Oh, you just joined today. I th I thought you were new. I thought I thought you weren't familiar. Yeah, welcome to the Toad Brigade. I appreciate you joining. All oh, right, okay. This is one of those um. This is one of those sections with the super ability. We're gonna get. Yep, yeah, we got. Oh, this one's one of my favorites actually. I like this one. Snowball. He gets to turn to a giant snowball and just careen himself down, down these hills and stuff. It's it's so cool, no pun intended, but it really is. Also, the freaking enemies hitting the screen. I just can't help but think of Smash. Oh, that Bronto Burt must have freaking had a. Yeah, that the Bronto Burt. Hey, what's going there, Beans? Welcome to Kirby. Okay, that's where the portal's gonna show up. Wait, where? Wait, where is it? Oh, I guess it's not in. Okay, I guess it's in the other section. I, f I forgot. Kirby would beat go Kirby could beat like anybody if he really wanted to. Kirby's Kirby's like OP. They need to nerf him. No, actually they don't. Oh, here's where it's gonna here's where it's gonna show up. It's gonna be right there. Hey, they they shouldn't be in the way. If they weren't in the way, they wouldn't have to get murdered. You know, Kirby, Kirby on the, Kirby, like, secretly is a mass murderer. Like, have you seen the stuff that he does? He's secretly a mass murderer. But then, then, then again, I could say the same for Mario. I mean, he's killed so many Goombas. He just steps on it. I, I, I don't know what happens to the Goombas when they die. What, yeah, guys, what happens to Goombas when they're, when they're, when they're dead? Like, when they get stumped on, do their soul, like, go to somewhere yeah that's a question for chat <laughs> what happens to goombas when they die what's going to hyper welcome to kirby i don't need that one up i have 24 lives they respawn oh boring i thought i thought it was gonna be something more interesting than just oh they just respawn Last time you played this game when it first released, so you don't remember much of the game. I would recommend the remake because they do they did add some content. Like they add the whole mass thing and the, the little mini game theme park. Like if you're if you're playing this game just for like the experience of the original game, then I probably wouldn't recommend it. But for the new content, well, being that I've never played this game before this, I did get it. 
Like, sometimes people think, oh, well, if it's a remake of a game you've already played, it's not really worth it. Sometimes it is. I think this is one of those games that you could probably, like, double dip if you did play the original. What's going on here? Aaron and Mario Adventure Gamer. Welcome to Kirby Return to Dreamland Deluxe. Sings my last like I'm singing I'm bad. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh... There we go. We finished. We have finished. Dude, I love this remix. I love the kind theme remix. It's so good. It's such a good remix. Yeah, I win. Do I get a cookie? I'm not sure about Pokemon, but the rest of the Nintendo series, I could see Lego sets for. I mean, Pokemon. That's only if Nintendo wants to do that. I don't. I don't know. I don't know if they. I don't know if they will. Oh, we got. We got that. Okay, good. Yeah, I get. Yeah, I do get a cookie. I do get a cookie. Star Allies is like it's 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 a um it's not my favorite Kirby title, but like I did see where it, where it was going, like with the dip with the different stuff they added to the game. But man, Forgotten Land, that game is freaking flawless. Like I can't I can't think of one bad thing about Forgotten Land. Like, but then again, I could I could have that whole meme that says Kirby's never had a ter a single bad game. I mean that's really too that's really oh 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 leaf i i actually want leaf i want leaf again because leaf is so fun to use i dude leaf is like leaf is probably in my like top top five kirby abilities i don't ever hear anybody talk about it like leaf is so good I mean, of course Mario was going to get a Lego set because, you know, it's it's Mario. He was always going to he was always going to get a Lego set. That's that's pretty much a given. But like the other the other franchises, yeah, they'll probably have to wait a little bit. What's going on? Nazigi, welcome to Kirby. Return to Dreamland Deluxe. Kirby said leap this stage of oh gosh. <laughs> I miss I miss all the <laughs> Just the the really the really really bad. Oh, oh my god. You you should have been here yesterday, uh Muffin, cause like <laughs> I know you were probably busy, but man, some of the stuff I was saying yesterday. I, I don't even know how did we get into a whole like we got into an entire discussion about the origin of swear words I'm not even kidding. I don't even know how that started But we literally were talking about the origin of swear words at one point Like we were wondering where did the word shit come from? I don't <laughs> I have no idea how that conversation got started Fortnite has Legos too. Yeah, Fortnite gets Fortnite gets everything. Because it of course it does. Also SMG meet Wario. Wario is uh Wario is quite a character, I'll say that much. Oh no, that's fun. That's fun. It's fine. Uh, a lot, a lot of people forget to turn the notification bell in. 
I mean, I have I have people who um who forget to thumb the uh to thumbs up the stream too until I unless unless I like remind them, but. Wait, there's something there. I need I need another ability, don't I? Wait, where's um where's spear? Cause I think, oh, it's right, it's right here. There it is. What's going there, DJ Riulu? Welcome to Kirby. Welcome to Triple. Not Triple Deluxe. I'm saying every game but the right name. Oh my gosh, Triple Deluxe, really? Maybe in the future I'll be playing that one. Zelda, Pokemon, Kirby, Smash Bros. I no, nah, well, Smash Bros. would just be a compilation of different franchises if they did that. I wouldn't think Smash Bros. itself needs a Lego set, but like separate franchises, yeah, I could see it. Metroid, uh, Metroid, I don't think is really big enough. Honestly. Anything? Man, there are swear words. There are swear words in there. Don't... People just try to find every excuse. There are swear words in there. There's definitely swear words. Wait, what about my bank account? My bank account can't... My bank account is immune <laughs> to hacks. And no, Wario can't do anything about it either. Yeah, I, I wouldn't say Metroid isn't exactly a kid. A kid game. Well, it... Uh, what would you really classify Metroid? Like more of a teen type thing? I think kids would get... Well, thank you for the one-up that I didn't need. Okay, right here. There we go. Oh, one of these levels has like a... One of these levels has like a, um, a really weird maze. So you gotta get one of these, uh... Energy spheres from I I want to say it's the next level. Oh my gosh! I didn't want you to see Vor in my stream today. The only one who's gonna be doing all the voring is Kirby himself. Not whatever this is. That's just an Unagi. That's an Unagi wannabe. He wants to be Unagi so bad from the Mario series. Metroid's more for teens. Yeah, yeah, that it's kind of dark. It's a pretty dark series. What's going there, Barry Sun? Oh, there's the last one. Okay. Because Yoshi's too good to pay taxes. He's too good for that. Yoshi ain't about Yoshi ain't about the tax paying. Like, Yoshi's like, who needs taxes when I have whatever I have? <laughs> What's going there, Barry, son? Uh, how's it going? I got yours. Okay, there we go. You're back on your account. And your company fixed it. Yeah. What it? What had actually happened? Like, how did your? How did you get? How did your account get hacked? Like that the other day. Like, what had happened? I don't have an art channel. I'll make one. I'll make one after the stream is over. I'm gonna be doing um, Onion Ocean and the next uh level. I still don't understand why they call why are they called levels in Kirby? Like that's so confusing. Also, Tim like hype. Why are they called why are the areas called levels? 
Like, they've been doing that ever since uh, Kirby's Dream Land 2 and Kirby's Adventure. They've been calling these areas levels. Do I have to call each, like, separate level, like, stage then? Yeah, 10 like hype, guys. I think this is this I think this is the one that had that little maze section where you gotta like know which path to go or something. I th I wanna say this is the one. Thing is if you mess up, you gotta do the whole thing over again, which is like really annoying. Like I've got not not just the not just the section, but the whole, the entire the entire stage you gotta do over. Wait, what is Hey, YouTube hates me too. YouTube hates me. Wait, no, 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 no. I want to go in that door. I want to go in the door. I need, I need whatever's in here. There's no, okay, there's no energy sphere. Well, I'm going to just leave. This is a Hassan. Welcome to Kirby. How's it going? I, oh, oh, actually, I thought, I thought that was death right there. Can you have YouTube money? Yeah, you could have it because I don't need it. Oh, yep, yeah, this is the level. Okay, this is the level. It's not this one, but it's the next one. I think the, I think it's the third switch that I have to hit in the next area. But right now, I'm just gonna do this. It doesn't matter what you do in this one. I think the stars tell you which switch you have to hit, but like I never really figured out the pattern here. Cause see, it's still, see, it sometimes takes me on a path that I have to go, but then other times it goes off. See? Oh, nice. Hope you're having fun. I want my I want my tomato. But you know what? I want water. Water is actually good for water levels because Kirby can do like a more powerful water gun attack. It's good. This is another one of my favorite abilities. I love water. And I, I love the water, the, the water tower that he has for a, a hat. It's, it's so, oh, I'm going to have to get rid of it because I know I need, I need stone. Ah. Oh. I need stone because there's a section where I need to use this. I need it. What's going near uh Greg Wigglefan? I mean if you want to make a Waluigi account, I say go ahead. Wait, what about San is sand fan made too? Yeah, you need it right here. Cause that's the only way you can get down here. Cause there's a current, see? If you try if you try having Kirby swim down there, he's not gonna be able to get to that. So you have to use stone. And I actually I actually um I underestimated stone. I thought stone only had like turning into the block, but actually there's more to it. He could actually do a fist attack too if you hold down the um the B button and press up. Yeah, this is the room right here that I was talking about. So I believe it's the third. If, if it's not the third switch, I'm going to be. I'm going to scream into your ears. Into the mic. If it's not the third one. Please tell me I'm right. Of course, I had to do this a, f a couple of times before getting it. Yes, I don't have to scream. Yes, I did it. Dude, what is Paris doing? <laughs> hey, what's going on, Scott and Yusuke Knight? Welcome to Kirby. Kirby's Return to Dreamland. I've seen you swim before, Wario. You, you were swimming in Mario 64 DS. I know you probably didn't want to help Mario in that game, but you had to. You, you were forced to help Mario. I know it was very painful for you. I, I didn't, what? 
Okay, um, that just happened. Alrighty then. Dude, I don't know what is it, what it is with me making, like, stupid mistakes getting, like, the first time I actually, um, the first death I had in the last stream was, uh, was when I had Kirby swallow an enemy and I jumped, and I accidentally had him jump into a pit. And he, he couldn't, like, spit the enemy back out. But this, this time, wait, I think, oh, you know what? I know how it worked, because there was no water right here. So I accidentally used, oh, that was so stupid of me. What's going there, Libs? That was so dumb. Too bad Waluigi couldn't join. He was on vacation or something. Oh, yeah, we got another one. We got another one. Yeah, Monster Flame. When am I... Sonic Boom Rosalie. Well, you talking about you want me you want to see me stream that game? I have no idea if I'm even gonna I, I don't really think I have the a way to play it. Like I do have a 3DS emulator, but like I don't think it would stream those games very well. And then again, I hear Sonic Boom Rise of lyrics ain't nothing to write home about. Yeah, I know. I feel bad for killing Kirby. I feel so bad. No, Kirby's one of those franchises where it's like, I pretty much have to 100% a game because I feel bad if I don't. I feel really bad if I don't 100% a Kirby game. Because, you know, there's some games that have a different ending if you don't 100% and like, Kirby gets kind of sad if you don't 100% his games. And I don't want to see Kirby cry. So I 100% like pretty much every Kirby game I've done so far. Yes, and that's going to include this one as well. I'm probably I'm um I don't think I'm going to be going for all the masks though, because that doesn't I don't think that counts for 100. percent Oh, this is really, this is fun. Yeah, do that. Yeah, I did see that, Rosie. I did see that. But the em the emulator I use is actually well, it's it's the one that Nintendo shut down, and like the reason why it's not because of the three it wasn't the three DS emulator that they that they shut down just to shut that down, but it was because of the the Switch emulator because people they were charging people to use that they were they were actually charging people for like Breath of the Wild, Tears of the Kingdom um content and stuff like that. It was it was a very very shady practice that they were doing I 100% Amazing Mirror when I streamed it I think wait were you you weren't here when I did Amazing Mirror were you I think you were No, I didn't ask for your opinion, sir. What's going to Agile? Welcome to Kirby. Welcome to Kirby in the Amazing Mirror. <laughs> also, if you're new, thanks for subscribing, by the way. Oh, this is one of my favorite abilities with Spear. I love when you, like, hold it down and, like, like when you charge it up and then just let go. Kirby starts, like, flying in the air like a little helicopter. It's so fun. And you even, he even gets more mobility than just flying normally because he flies faster with it. Amazing Mirror introduced... Amazing Mirror introduced the whole Dempster. Did you know Dempst designed Amazing Mirror? Uh, Muffin, did you know that... that yeah, Dempst. You know the this, this same company that does like... The weirdly designed Sonic games. Yeah, they actually did a ama I I didn't even know that until I beat the game. I was like, Dimps did this? Like really? But yeah, it was it was quite a a quite a revelation for me. I did not even know that. I saw in the credits, I said, oh my gosh. But yeah, it's um I don't know 
know if they did return, I mean, not return to Dreamland, Nightmare in Dreamland. I don't know if they did that one. Well, then again, they they probably did, but they didn't really have to do anything with it because it wasn't an original game. It was a remake, but Amazing Mirror was an original game. <laughs> and they actually, they actually did, they did the game. Oh my gosh. And man, you can tell, you can tell when they do their games because, gosh, the enemy placement. <laughs> Return to Dreamland was your first Kirby game. I think after, either that was after that or Epic Epic Yarn. Epic Yarn. I did I did Kirby's extra Epic Yarn. I think la it was early last year. I did that game. It was it was it was all right. It wasn't it wasn't my like out of all the games I've done Kirby related. That probably was my least favorite one so far. I wasn't really a big fan of Epic Yarn. It. It was cool, like the art style. I did like the art style and stuff, but I, I don't know. That Kirby game wasn't really, I wasn't really feeling it as much. I don't know. Maybe it was because it, it didn't really have, well, I, I mean, the first game didn't either, but it didn't really have copy abilities. Instead, it had like certain transformations, but uh, it was it was good for what it was. It just wasn't really my favorite Kirby game. But I, I, I've, I, I've been to talk about Princess Peach Showtime. That's the game I'm not going to be getting. I'm not getting that game because that's another game I could say, like, from what I've seen, from what I've seen and played the, of the demo, it's just, it's not a game for me. And you know what? That's, that's completely fine. If the game's not for you, like. It's fine. Like, you don't have to play every game that exists. Yeah, I don't have any money in my wallet, so you're you're gonna have to deal with it. I have no money in my wallet. Okay, don't hit that switch. Now you can hit it. There we go. Doesn't matter. Oh, good siren! Sirens in the background. Yep, I was missing that. I I'm surprised I didn't get any of that yesterday. There was not a single siren in my in my five and a half hour stream I did yesterday. Paris is just mean. She's a she's such a bully. Also, oh, this is a really good song, by the way. But man, I cannot wait to get to level six because, dude, the one of the levels I think it's the second level of levels the second stage of level six i i really hate that they call it levels like it, it never made sense to me but yeah it has a really really awesome theme that's such a bop and i cannot wait to talk about it and, and, and i'd argue it's the best theme in the whole game and i know oh some people some people actually made comments saying oh this song tries so hard to be factory inspection from kirby 64 I I don't see the resemblance, but um, it's still it's still really really good. Okay, so you see you see that on the other side there, you can kind of see there's a door behind that seaweed. Yeah, because there is a, there is a door back there. See, and that's how you get to that door. And we need to go over here. Oh wait 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 lollipop! I need a lollipop. Hey, thanks, Tabitha. <laughs> you named your crazy horse Dimps? Oh my god. That's actually not a bad name for a horse. I'm not gonna lie. That's a pretty <laughs> That's a pretty good name for a horse. But yeah, go in this door. True Arena is always hard. In fact, oh, oh my god, I just remember I gotta, sh dude, I I never played the True Arena of this game. I heard it was pretty damn brutal. Oh, I just forget, and that goes in hundred percent in this. G oh no, <laughs> that goes in hundred percent in this game. I have to do it the True. I, I like I beat, I can beat the Arena just fine, but dude, the True Arena. 
The one with the the one with the souped up boss fights. Oh no. <laughs> oh that's that's good that's gonna be fun. Oh yeah, you should. You should stream the Luigi mod of Sunshine. Which, by the way, can you guys believe I still have not streamed Super Mario Galaxy or Super Luigi Galaxy? I still have not done that game yet. Oh, I gotta do 3D World. Oh, yeah, you know what? Since since you're here at the channel, you could probably do 3D World. Because I need... To, I'm gonna... After I finish, like, the main story... Like, I'm doing the main... I'm doing the main levels, like, myself. And then I'm gonna have other people with me for the extra levels. Or the post-game. So, like, I could probably do that. I, no, I did not do 3D World yet. I'm doing that for my next Mario game. It's already been confirmed. Don't worry, I wasn't going to use Luigi. I was, I'm probably going to end up using... Uh, I'm not using Peach. That's not happening. <laughs> I ain't using her. I ain't using that princess bitch. <laughs> but I will be using someone else though. I think I'll probably end up using um Toad. And I know I know Toad has to like the really low jump. But I'll I I can deal with it. I'm doing the first half, like the first portions of the game myself, and then I'm doing, with, I'm doing the post game with other people. There we go. Cleaning out Delfino will not give you money. Nope. You got to do it all for free. I know you hate hearing that word. <laughs> That's like Mr. Krabs had to. Uh, he had to pay. He had to do something for free, and he hated. It. No, I. How did I mess that up? How did I mess that up? I'm using Toad because Yellow Toad, but even though he's not yellow, he's blue. I know he's based on like the the characters you can play as in 3D World is based off of Super Mario Bros. 2. Like they have like basically the same abilities. Like Peach has the high jump. No, Luigi has the high jump. Peach has the floaty jump. Um, Mario is like just this, just the average, well-rounded character, and Toad is fast but jumps very really low. Holy crap! You're actually right. It is that bomb from Link to the Past, the giant bomb that can blow up that wall at the pyramid area. It is the bomb. And I just, I just hurt Kirby again. Yeah, Princess Bitch. That's, that's her name, right? That, I, yeah, I'm pretty sure I got that right. Her name, her name was never Peach. It was always Princess Bitch. Correct me if I'm wrong. I don't think anyone's going to correct me because I'm right. I still gotta play Mario Party 6, by the way, and, uh, I don't know whether I should be excited or anxious about streaming Mario Party 6, because we are, we already know what happened with 5, gosh, man, I don't know what, I don't know what I did to Mario Party 5, but, dude, I only won two of those boards, it was, it was an absolute disaster, bro. Wait, you talking about the you talking about doing the uh you had to get the bomb linked to the past like multiple times because you were trying to you were trying to do something else, but they kept giving that to you. I know the feel. Where's this last energy sphere? Is it? Did I miss it? I did Mario Party 4 already. I got the only ones that I have left is Mario Party 6 and 7. And eight, if I can actually do that game too. I oh I 
I totally missed it. I'm, I think I know where it is. It's, it's like behind one of these eels. Oh, you only got to do it once. Well, that's, uh, that's relieving. It's, yep, yeah, there it is. I found it. What's going on, David? David's the one who's like, he's really, he's really um, excited to see me do another Sonic game. I get a lot of people like been when been waiting for me to play a certain a certain game from a franchise. But the thing is, I don't do like the same franchise like too close together cuz then that that would cause me like fatigue from like a certain game. That's why I didn't choose to do Sonic so soon. I'm waiting I'm I'm going to get the, I'm going to eventually get the Sonic Mania though cuz like I dude, I'm so I'm so happy I'm going to be doing that next. Uh I can't wait to play Sonic Mania again. Oh, yeah, it's a boss fight. They are called stages. Okay, they're called stages. Because the worlds are called levels. Eight might be a tough one. I don't think it'll be fun without a Wii Remote. Yeah, that's why I don't know about eight. I think Paris is more greedy. I think, I think she's greedier than Wario. Wario's getting, um... Yeah, Wario's getting sized up now. Uh, what ability do I want? You know, I'm gonna stick with Spear. Also, fun fact, this is actually Bandana D's ability. Yeah, did you know that? If you didn't know, now you do. Fatty Puffer is the, is the name. Dude, I don't know who comes up with these Kirby boss names, but they're they're so good. Remember remember the most the, the most original name, Ice Dragon. Remember that? Dude, look how broken this is. Look at this. Like you could just Dude, that that is that's almost as broken as Tornado, bro. You could just like have that just keep hitting the boss over and over again. Yeah, it's Mrs. Puff. Dude, Mrs. Puff low key is one of my favorite SpongeBob characters because I I love how she like she's so dismissive. Every time she sees SpongeBob, she just thinks of the worst. Like she doesn't want anything to do with him. <laughs> She, she literally gave him extra credit to try to, like, sneak past him so she wouldn't have to deal with him anymore. Like, dude. She knew it was wrong, but she did it anyway because she didn't want to deal with him anymore. Freaking love Mrs. P I don't hear too many. I don't, like, Mrs. Puff is an underrated Spongebob character. I'm sorry, but she is. Oh, remember the episode where they did this? They did the demolition derby, and Mrs. Puff tried to literally kill him. She tried to kill SpongeBob because she went like batshit crazy. There's a music track in Dreamland 3 that reminds you of Earthbound. Uh, I don't, I don't know which one it is, but Dreamland 3. Well, I'm kind of iffy on that game, too. That's one of my lesser favorite Kirby games. I like the art style, and I do I do like the final boss, but getting to that final boss, like, 100% in that game is very, very tedious. I never enjoyed it. Welcome back, Kirby. With the left wing in place, the wings are finally complete. It's finally looking like a real star cutter again. If we can get these last two parts, the lore will be flying again in no time. Keep it up, Kirby. I believe in you. See, Megalore believes in us. I'm actually going to go over here real quick. I need to get an ability. At least Kirby 64 doesn't have a true arena. That's because it only had one one boss for each. There, there wasn't like a second boss fight. 
Okay, I'll take Sand, because Sand is so... Sand is such a cool ability. I like a lot of the abilities that they introduced in Dreamland. In Dreamland. Mrs. Puff should explode. You want to see... You want to see... Mrs. Puff die? It has to be Kirby 64. Okay, so we had... We had C, R, O. So now we have W for the next letter. We have White Wafers. I, 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 that name's kind of weird, but it's... It's still a food. But yeah, we're going by the letter. So now we have W. I'm not really a fan of this of this area. I'm not a fan of I don't know when it like in Kirby games ice levels really don't do it for me. You know how like in Mario games everyone complains about water in Kirby it's ice. <laughs> not a huge fan. I do like some of the some of the stages but I'm not a fan of this like world in general. Wait, can I can I have something for dinner? Also, part of this song reminds me of uh It it kind of reminds me a little bit of uh Wandaria from Forgotten Land. Like it reminds me of the uh one of the themes from that from that world. Wandaria is like the the uh the It's like the um what am I trying to say? It's like the wrecked amusement park area. Absolutely love it. But I'm not going to talk too much about Forgotten Land because I know like people, some people have not played that game yet. But but I will spoil that Forgotten Land is a great game. I'll say that much. It is a great Kirby game. It is really, really good. Uh, do I? Yeah, I need fire. You started playing Battle for Bikini. But wait, you got the remake or the original one? There we go. Yep, I needed it. Well, I would ask, do you have beans and rice? That that's actually pretty funny. Yeah, do you have do you have beans and rice? Actually, actually, I will say I do like the ice area in Forgotten Land. I do like that one. That's probably the exception when it comes to ice. Like Shiver Star has great music, but still, even there, I'm like, I'm not like a huge fan of ice levels in Kirby. Yeah, I know. You would you would have thought I would have said that about the water area, right? No, it's the ice. But yeah, this this definitely sounds like one Daria remains. Like it's so it resembles it so much. Oh, you're playing oh, you're playing the remake of uh Battle for Bikini Bottom. I you know I actually never played that game yet. Okay, right here is gonna be a um Right up there, you see, you can, you can, it's kind of obvious, but yeah, just have the cannon shoot him up, and there you go. No! I knew that was going to happen. I think, I think armchair left or something. Oh, oh no, he's back. He's back. He says ice, ice, baby. I cannot believe I made that mistake. No, no, I did. I did it again. I, I did it again. Oh my. God. <laughs> yeah, I just voluntarily killed Kirby.
I'm not doing it a third time. I'm not. I refuse to do it a third time. Dude, how did I... How did I make that mistake twice? Hey, this doesn't remind me of Donkey Kong Country 2 at all. Nope, not at all. I'm gonna go this way. Yeah, I know what that's a reference to. That's a reference to that song. Believe me, I know. Oh my god, they killed Kirby. You barely... Yeah. Thanks, South Park. Thanks, Cartman. Dude, Kirby is so fat. Wait, does this give me water? Oh, it does. Okay, good. I know some of my reactions might be a little bit like before it shows on OBS. That's because OBS has like a a second delay. I don't know why. I think it's because it's an out it's an outsource um thing I'm using to stream. Like if I was streaming off the laptop, it wouldn't be any delay at all. But on OB when you're using an OBS capture device, it has like that little delay. So my apologies if my reactions happen sometimes before it happens in the game. It's not my fault. It's OBS Studio. There we go, I'll use this. Wario being Wario was a snowman in Wario Wario Land 3 and 4. Being <laughs> Tabitha has leftovers. Wait, where's the beans and rice? Hey, Wario will be fine. Wario, he'll be fine. This area kind of reminds me of the of the ice, the snow theme from uh, New Super Mario Bros. No, we're actually playing The Legend of Zelda right now. This isn't Kirby. We're playing Zelda. Dude, can someone explain why that series is called The Legend of Zelda, by the way? Why is it not called this The Legend of Link? Because Link is the hero of Legend, not Zelda. Like, Zelda's usually the character that has to be, like, rescued or something like that. So why is it called Legend of Zelda? I, I, there, there might be some explanation by Nintendo as to why they named it The Legend of Zelda, not Link. But I don't have a problem with it. I don't have a problem with it with the um the series name or anything. I'm j I'm just kind of wondering why. Hey, thanks, Tabitha. Also, speaking of Legend of Zelda, those are totally not Helmosaurs. Those little guys with the uh with the iron mask on their face that you gotta. You gotta either like pull their mask off or whatever. That's to that's totally not a helmet sword. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Zelda's not useless. No, Zelda is not Princess Bitch. She's not. She's she's not like Peach. <laughs> well, Peach has actually showed that she can um she can do stuff. She showed that she can do stuff. I still hate her in Mario Party, like in Mario Party, she's still she's still the worst character in the in the entire series. Wait, no, Ribbon is in on in Star Allies too. She's part of one of the um. She's part of one of those other things. Wait, can I? They say you need Ninja to do that. You can actually just use Mech. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Zelda, Zelda's been helpful. Also, how would you guys rate the Mario movie, by the way? 
did you guys like the Mario movie? I personally, I loved it. Some of some of the Mario movie, like there were some, there were some areas that was like a little bit awkward, but I actually, I really liked the Mario movie. The Mario movie was like the best way they could have introduced Mario to the big screen. And no, I'm I'm not talking about that 1993. Not that one. <laughs> not that one. Even though I, I do, I will say, I do have a little bit of a guilty pleasure for the original, like the other Super Mario Bros. movie. I do. As, as cheesy as it was and as off-putting as a lot of the scenes were, I did have some sort of a guilty pleasure with it in certain, in certain spots. I didn't absolutely hate the original Super Mario Bros. One movie I did more so despise, though, as an animated video game movie was uh, the second Wreck-It Ralph. Like, I I couldn't really... I couldn't really relate to it like the first one. Can I... Okay, there we go. Like, the the, the, the first one was um was written a lot better than the second. The second one felt like more of a cash grab, if anything. Like, it wasn't the worst thing I've seen, but... It could have been, it could have and should have been much better. I play Forgotten Land and it's a great, it's a great game. Oh, she was complaining, go figure. She said, why wasn't, why wasn't, um, why couldn't Peach be the one to save, uh, to beat, to beat Bowser. She probably was complaining like that, wasn't she? Also, as much as, like, I know Stone is, like, not the best ability, but... No, the best ability is clearly Sleep, which... Actually, I never talked about. I never talked about how good Sleep is. It's... The, it's the best ability in, in any Kirby game. It's so good. Like, Kirby sleeps for, like, a whole, like, seven seconds... Like who do, who doesn't like that ability? It's so it's so overpowered. They, they need to nerf sleep, like seriously. <laughs> I've I've beaten so many bosses using just that ability. And like I've even beaten up uh, the arena one time with sleep. Gosh, man. Also, it's bonkers. Soup wait, no, it's super bonkers. That sounds like the name of a like a Smash Bros, uh, a bootleg Smash Bros game, Super Bonkers. It literally sounds like a Smash Bros clone or something. Now we got Grand Hammer. Yeah, they did. They tr they they what they did with the second record Ralph was like. They pushed the whole, oh, we're Disney, we own all of these different characters and stuff. That's more of what the second movie was. And, like, I, I didn't I didn't like what they did with the characters. Like, considering how much character development was in the first movie, they totally, for, it's like they totally forgot what made those characters so good in the first movie. Because, man, Ralph became, like, needy and clingy to Vanellope. Vanellope became more of, like, selfish. I think that was more... Ralph was pretty selfish, too, in his own way, but... They totally just messed up the characters, bro. They really did. And then, then you got Felix and Calhoun, who, were, who weren't even in, like, the second movie. Pretty much at all until, like... I think it was, like, maybe, like, one or two scenes that they showed up in. And then that was it for them. And, like, I thought that the whole thing with those characters could have been fun with them, like, adopting all the people. All the, uh characters from sugar rush but no they didn't do much with it what's going there matt wreck it ralph 2 isn't real yeah i like to pretend it doesn't even exist much like the fourth home alone movie it doesn't exist either it's a figment of your imagination But yeah, Disney's been out of touch for a long time, though. Like, that's not the first time Disney's done something. 
that was very questionable. I like the third one. I know that's kind of unpopular, but I did like the third one. When it came to the Home Alone. Oh my gosh, this freaking Waddle D. The the third the third one was like it was it wasn't the best one but like it it was good it was good enough. The fourth one is the fourth one is non-existent garbage. Fifth one again fifth one was okay and then the I didn't see the last one because there is a sixth one believe it or not. Yeah, there actually is six Home Alone movies and. Gosh, the, the the sixth one just totally like retconned the entire like existence of. No, wait, that's the fourth one I'm talking about. But the, the dude, the sixth one is um. They make you feel bad for the quote unquote burglars. Like, <laughs> you know it's not a good uh, you know it's not a good one if they make you feel bad for the burglar care because the burglar care is oh they were trying there was a huge misunderstanding which um yeah. Not good. I really like, oh, more Disney franchise flexing instead of more video game characters. Wait, what you mean flexing more video game characters? I don't, I kind of don't get it. I kind of, I kind of don't get it. I don't know, how do you got in discussion about Disney movies? Like, this was like out of left field, but I need something to talk about anyway. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't hate the fifth Home Alone movie. I actually, I actually, I kind of. I'm not gonna say I loved it. But I kind of liked it. Like it definitely wasn't the. It definitely wasn't the quality of the first two. It would. It would never be that good. But or even the third. The third one was better than the fifth one too. The third one, I would probably, if I had to rank the, if I had to rank the movies from like best to worst, it's the first one, then the second one. Then the third one, then the fifth one, then the sixth one, then the fourth one. <laughs> I think four was the absolute worst. Because they they totally just like forgot the entire story of the first and second movie. And then they just did their own thing with it. And of course, of course, what company did the fourth movie? Uh, It was Disney. Yeah. Already a bad sign. It was Disney. Disney used to be so good too. Like they used to be... They used to be masters at making great movies. Now they just like the milk franchises and and stuff. Okay, okay, that's not an energy sphere. Okay, I don't need to worry about it then. Oh well, Disney doesn't have Disney has the rights to all those different characters. That's why they that's why they do what they do. But yeah, like I said. Wreck it, R Ralph. It, it, it even the title like pisses me off too. It was called Ralph Breaks the Internet when they had the name Wreck It Ralph right there, bro. Why didn't they just call it Ralph Wrecks the Internet? The name they they even had like one of those um trailers, even make fun of the fact that they didn't call it Ralph Wrecks the Internet. That's how they they knew exactly what they were doing. <laughs> they knew what they were doing by not naming it Ralph Wrecks the Internet. Oh my gosh. And like, why wasn't why wasn't the second why wasn't the second film why wasn't it based off of the um like why wasn't the console world the console gaming world that that was a concept that definitely could have happened but no instead instead they decided the internet was a better idea no it wasn't it was not a better idea at all yeah break it Ralph not nearly as cool of a name. Also, we got ice balls. Those are some big balls. Oh, I actually died right here one time because I wasn't paying attention to the big ball. All right, we got this. I got about this invisibility crystal.
Yeah, if you want to make yourself happy, pretend like certain movies don't exist. You'll you'll be in a much better a much better state of mind. Oh hey, there's another big ball. I think Wreck and Ralph should have gotten a sequel, but it shouldn't have been the one that we did that we ended up getting. Like I don't mind Wreck and Ralph having a sequel, but the 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 one the sequel that we got, what we ended up getting was not good. And I've, I've noticed some people going to say, oh, um, the second Wreck and Ralph was actually good. Well, that's completely fine if you think that, but I, I don't think it was a good movie. I really don't. It was, it was average at best, and at worst, it was horrible. Okay, let's do this, and then... I made the same mistake again. I forgot I had to, like, move out of the way of that quickly before the platform uh, falls. What? Guys, there's another death for Kirby. Yay. Gosh, I'm being such an ass to Kirby. I'm being such an ass. Like, how many deaths was that? Was that five or six? No! I almost died again. Oh, I almost died again. Oh my gosh. Okay, there we go. That's better. Oh, you might main that weapon now? Nice. Oh my gosh, Beans, you are a savage. <laughs> you hate how the Disney princesses were handled in the movie. Yeah, the princesses weren't handled weren't handled well at all. And like one thing about Wreck It Ralph that I liked is that they didn't have to they didn't have to force a whole Disney musical number. They did that in the second film, which was another thing I didn't like. They they had they had to force a musical number in that film. Like why? That was one thing that made Wreck It Ralph unique is that they didn't have music in a Disney film. Because it didn't need it. Uh, of, of course the sequel had to have a freaking musical in it. Like, okay, I messed this up. I'm not really a fan of this. No, no! Uh, gosh, I'm dying so much. Well, admittedly, this is when the game starts to get more difficult, so I can... I can understand why these deaths are happening. Yeah, I'll leave you right there. Oh, oh, that's, that's, that's good. Wait. <coughs> Wait, which princess are you to, are you referring to, uh, Armchair? Water got borrows. I mean, will ice be your weakness cuz you know water freezes? Yeah, Disney ain't cooking no more. No, actually, you know what? No, Disney is still cooking, but they're they're cooking water instead of something actually good. They're cooking water. You know you're bad when you can only cook water. Okay, there's yeah, the last one's right here. Oh yeah, oh Elsa from Fro. Oh. Uh, freaking Elsa. Yeah, they told, and like, I, I don't, I don't know, man. I think if Wario ran Disney, it would be better off. It probably would be better off, not gonna lie.
Also, we're close to 20 on the likes. Thank you guys very, very much. Let me see. How many how many stages is left? It's one. We got two. Okay, we got two more. Dude, these stages are getting long. Tech the cooler, that's what that's that that's that supportive um special, isn't it? The one that gives like extra ink to everybody on your team. Don't ask me if I seen the Frozen movie because I did not. I that's not a movie for me. No, 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 no. I gotta go back. I gotta go back. I gotta go back. There was there was a. I gotta go back. There was a um a energy spirit like with that cannon back there. I remember because you gotta really be paying attention. Frozen's okay. Uh, it's still it's still not something I would want to go see or anything. Like I'm I'm not gonna drop all my stuff to go see Frozen. <laughs> now if you if you ask me if I wanted to go see Okay, if you ask me if I wanted to see a Mariah Carey concert if it was in my area, yeah I would go. Yeah, I don't care. Or I don't care I don't Mariah Carey. But I would. I actually would. I could see a concert. But no, she's not going to be in my area. She's going to be all the way over on the West Coast. What's going there, Jake? I think I said this at one point yesterday. I was like... I said, yeah, I'm a grown-ass black dude who listens to her music and I don't care. Because her music is actually good. That's why I listen to it. It's not... It's, qua it's quality stuff, man. It's good, unlike some of the stuff you hear nowadays. Like, oh my god, the stuff you hear nowadays is, like, unbearable. I can't listen to it. I really can't. I cannot listen. I can't listen to a lot of the music nowadays. I can't. Wait, why you hate King Ramsey so much? And Canto 3. I have not seen those movies, actually. I have not seen the Encanto film. Oh, this is a pretty cool puzzle, so you gotta get to the bottom before that guy does and grab the key from him. This one's easy. There is a there is a harder one later on, but this one's not bad. See, we already made it. It's like a little bit of a race. I used to... I did the wrong... I wasn't... Uh, I gotta die now. Uh... Yeah, you guys find the witness Kirby dying. In fact, I'm going to let Gordon Ramsay kill me. Gordo Ramsay. Yeah, I came up with that one today. You guys like it? <laughs> you don't hate King Ramsay? I was just curious, Beans. Okay, let's do this again. With 100% less fit. I cannot believe I used the key on the wrong freaking door. That was so, that was so bad. I heard Brave was pretty good, but like, again, that's a movie that I wasn't really, I wasn't really wanting to see it. But I heard that was a good one. Open the bottom door, guys, not the top. Oh, I love this song that's playing right now. Oh, I wish we could hear more of it. It's so like it's so icy and cool. But unfortunately, it's going to be interrupted by the super ability theme. Now we get to play a little bowling. Gordo Gordon Ramsay, where's the lamb sauce? 
But did you guys get the pun, Gordo Ramsey? Because the enemies are called Gordos. Yeah. I hope you got the reference. But if you get a strike, you get extra rewards from the little party ball. Which is totally not something from Smash. It's totally not a Smash thing. What? Okay, why can't I do this correctly? Well, that's not going to be a strike now because I already hit a pin. I wanted a strike, man. Why can't I get a strike? No, no, go. Kirby. Okay, fine. I'll do it like this. I, w I wanted to be a badass and do it like while he was rolling, but no, I guess the game didn't want me to do it that way. People are picking on what weapons are good. I think the Dapple Dwallies are good. And the Tactic Cooler is awesome. I never used the Tactic Cooler special. I know I know how it works, but I've, I've, I never really used it. Because I was always more of an offensive player when it came to Splatoon. I was never more of like the, the more support character. But I can play support even with some of the weapons that I like using. I will crush you. I don't care about that one up. I don't need it. Ouch. I like I I think I mentioned I'm not going to be doing the um the extra mode, but I am going to be doing the true arena. That's why I'm going to go to my other file. I am going to show off the masks and stuff too. I got a favorite mask in this game. But that's going to be that's not going to be until a little bit later cuz um on this file, this was a completely new file, and I'm not going to be unlocking all those masks. Playing all those mini games uh, multiple times to try to unlock everything. Nope. Not happening, bro. I like cherries. You guys, what's your favorite fruit? What is your favorite fruit? Do you like cherries? Apples, oranges, banana. I'm a I'm a banana guy. No jokes, please. But I actually am a banana guy. Like bananas are just so good. Besides, I like banana pudding too. It's such a it's such a delicacy. You like cherries more cherries cherries are um they're they're i think cherries is like a really good like spring summertime fruit but i i hate the ones with the seeds in it because you gotta you gotta like eat around the seed and then spit the seed out. I'm, i was never really a fan of the ones with seeds like if, if, if i want to have a, a fruit that i can just eat in one bite i'd rather have something that doesn't have a seed in it You always are a smart ass beans. I know if I know Wario's favorite fr Wario's favorite fruit is garlic. <laughs> uh No, garlic doesn't have any seeds in it. Yeah, you're right. It doesn't. Oh, Checkerboard Chase. Dude, that's my favorite of the mini games. I love Checkerboard Chase so much. That's from Kirby64. Uh... Oh, yes, we get to hear this theme more. Yes. In fact, it plays for like this whole stage, and I love it. I just listen to it. This is probably like my third favorite theme in the whole game. Summertime's the best. Yeah, I love I love like summer for like the vacation time and stuff like that. But I'm not really a fan of like how hot it is. I don't think anybody's gonna argue with that. Like that that sweltering heat. Uh. 
But I can I can definitely deal with everything else. Like I I, I actually I really like summer. The heat is the only issue I have with it. But you know, and for the record, I don't I don't like winter because I don't like the winter cold either. Just to let you guys know, I'm not a fan of any extreme temperature. But if I had to deal with one, I'd rather deal with summer, honestly. Because, man, winter is... Oh, my gosh. Okay, this is another puzzle here. Uh, we got to take this across these platforms. I'm going to have to go back, by the way, because... I thought you were going to use my nickname for Peach, Princess Bitch, but Princess Dick works too. I want to get rid of it. There we go. Wario could run a taco stand. Dude, we did two whole levels. And we, um... And we only did about an hour and a half for a stream. I wonder how many streams this game is going to take for me to be done. And I, I don't even know what game I'm going to be doing after this. Oh, I think... Did I mention... It, it might end up being Wario Land Virtual Boy, actually. That's going to be a very short project. No, 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 no! See, that's why I don't like Ice. That is why I don't like Ice and Kirby. I always die because... I'm, I move more than I want to. Oh. There's another death. Yeah, princess bitch is right. I really, really am not a fan of the slipperiness. Oh, soup! I mean, that's ramen. I like ramen. Dude, ramen is like one of my favorite. Oh, I didn't need. I died for nothing. I didn't even need the uh, the freaking um cannon. I died for. I killed Kirby for nothing, guys. Wait, I need mech for this. Get out of here, Helmosaur. This game's gonna take a hundred, a hundred playthroughs. Gotcha. If, it take, if it takes me that long to beat a Kirby game, then there's a huge problem. Hey, what's going there, Shadow? Welcome to Kirby Return to Dreamland Deluxe. Oh, no, I gotta... Oh, I forgot I have to go down. Okay. You guys welcome Shadow, another content creator. I gotta do this again. Oh, how was your premiere of Donkey Kong 64? Dude, what if I stream Donkey Kong 64 at some point? Dude, that game is so... That, that game would take, like, maybe, like, 20 parts to finish because it's such a huge game. Okay, there we go. I got it. Dude, why is the music in this game so good? Why is it so good? I can tell you why, because it's Kirby. It's a Kirby game. Kirby games usually have good music. Hey, stop making fun of Kirby dying. I Look, I'm not intentionally killing Kirby during a lot of this. <laughs> I'm not intentionally killing him. I'm making I'm making stupid mistakes. They're not meant to be. Let's unlock this door right here. 
Dude, if I'm dying this much in like the normal mode, I can only imagine if I did extra mode. But I, like I said, I'm not, I'm not doing a whole nother playthrough. I might show up with the. No, no, no. I don't need to because in True Arena we're gonna see that extra boss anyway. Also, dark area. Hate it. This reminds me of dark ghost houses in Mario Maker 2. Not a fan of this. This is another gimmick in, in platformers I never like. Darkness. Uh... Oh, I'm fine. Okay, good. Good. I don't have to be chastised then. There's something back here. There's definitely something. There we go. Death defying mistakes. Yup. Oh, I know what I gotta do here. Okay, so. No, don't throw the candle at him. I gotta do the ice ball. Uh, how do you do it again? Oh, down B while dashing. Okay. I'm trying to do it, but it's not working. Why is it? Oh, wait. You don't jump. That's why. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I don't... I don't like... I don't like darkness in platformers. It's, it just makes things annoying and stuff. It really does. Not a fan of it. Hey, I got a one-up. That makes up for the deaths that I did. That I didn't mean to. We got one more super um, energy sphere left. And there it is. Right there in the open. And we get festival... Wait, doesn't Festival have, like, a secondary? Oh, I can't do... Okay, so this is just a screen nuke, but if you have friends you're playing with, it can you can do, like, a, um, a different dance or something. But like I said, Festival became, like, its own actual copy ability. Like, not just a screen nuke. And, um, in one of the later Kirby games, it became a whole ability, which is pretty neat. I like when they do that. When they make an ability that once that used to be one thing and it becomes another. But still, overall, sleep is still the best ability. Like, no cap. Sleep is sleep will always be the best ability in Kirby. Okay, we got a boss fight. I should use sleep to defeat him, but there's no way I can get it. Greed, Greedendorf, Greedendorf. Okay, what is going to be our boss this time, guys? Well, it's not, at least it's not Wispy Woods. No, they wouldn't be that uncreative. You know, what? I'm going to stick with fire because, well, we're in an icy area. Fire would only make sense. I have to find a raid target, too. Oh, who is this? Goliath. Is that a pun on Goliath? Like, is that is that the name that they're trying to reference? Wario says he's the boss fight. Okay, all of a sudden, I don't know if fire was, like, the best option here. Because it's not seeming to do as much damage. Yeah, this guy, this guy, this is an Asian, um... Y 
Yeah, I, I'm at the boss now of White Wafers. But this, this ability is not really doing it for this boss. Like, Aider King, boo. Oh my gosh, he, he totally went Super Saiyan. I can keep spamming out the fire breath. Ah, you missed me. You missed me. I'm so dead, though, because, like... Oh, that was close. Dude, what is this boss music, by the way? This boss music is so good. But name one time I didn't say the music was good in this game. Because I've said it so much. Oh, no, I died just before beating him. Damn it. Oh, I died just before beating him. I knew, if I knew, I, like, I, I could have clutched that win. Yeah, how's it going, King Boo? The son of a shepherd. Dude, Rolf was like... Rolf was such a character in that show. He really was. I should watch some of that show after the stream is over. I really should. Dude, he got me with the freaking, um, Mr. Fantastic arm. Like, that's how, that's how I died. I died to the freaking arm. The long arm of the law. Can you, can you please? I think a lot of people are nostalgic for Return to Dreamland because it was one of the, um, one of the best Kirby games. Yeah, he went Super Saiyan again. We totally, we totally didn't see this before. Yeah, we totally got him this time. We barely took any any damage. Yeah, I should have, I should have used Ninja the first time. I, I would have beaten him. And there he goes. Never to be seen ever again. Yeah, we'll, we'll never see that guy again. Never. Never. Of course we're going to see him again. Who am I kidding? <laughs> and there we go, guys. That was White Wafers. We 100% White Wafers. Now, let me look for a raid target because this stream is pretty much done now. Wow, we got to an hour and 40 minutes, which is pretty good. He'll be a plush. You know, honestly, I would buy a plush of that, of that boss. I, I actually would. Hey, Magalore. We got your... Other part back. Kirby, you've done it. My star cutter finally got his emblem back. Oh, joyous, glorious day. There's only one missing part left to find. And remember, once this up and running, I'll take you on a visit to my home. Crushing here on your planet, meeting you. Somehow, despite what an ordeal has turned out to, it was worth it. Thank you yet again for all your help and for being such a cool dude. He called Kirby cool. I feel I feel so good about that. He called Kirby cool. 100% the world crazy. I know. Oh, look, we have six. Wait, I think we had 64. This say 64. It did. 64 out of 120 energy spheres. Insane. Anyway, let me look for somebody to raid. I must look for someone. 
Actually, I found somebody. I found somebody. Okay, so level five is called Nutty Noon. So we have N. I, I love the name Nutty Noon. Like, who came, who came up with that one? So yeah, C-R-O-W-N. That spells crown. <laughs> anyway, uh, so I got Linkario, guys. <laughs> Nintendo came up with it. Gosh. Yeah, Liv is the late, late Linkario, guys. I'm sure she'll be very happy... There we go. But yeah, guys, thanks for joining me for Kirby's Return to Dreamland Deluxe. So, I'm not streaming tomorrow. Tomorrow's my birthday. I want to just relax and have a good time with fam. So, that's exactly what I'm going to be doing. I'm, I might do a short little something, but not much. But most likely, I'm not going to be doing anything tomorrow in terms of my channel. I just want to kind of relax. But I will be... No, sa wait. Saturday, I... I could probably stream. I might stream Saturday for Splatfest. If not, then I'll see you guys for more of uh, Majora's Mask 3D. <laughs> yeah, guys. So anyway, this has been your host, Rob Morrison. Thanks for joining. Till next time, bye-bye.